River State weatherman answering to charges for the murder of seven women in different hotels in Rivers, Lagos and Emo States, gracious David West will soon know his fate. This is coming after nine months of trial at the State High Court in Portacot. Now it has come to an end. Correspondent Ucho Okoro tells us more. This court sitting was for councils to adopt and respond to their final written addresses in the matter that began on the 20th of November 2019. The prosecution is demanding the death penalty for the first defendant, while the defense counsel argued that his client's guilt was not proven beyond reasonable doubt as required by law. The second defendant faces a lighter sentence of two years in prison if convicted for moving the corpse of one of the victims from a hotel in Port Harcourt without legal authorization. Their death came as a result of the act of the first defendant, who in his own extrajudicial statement confessed to the crime. He confessed to the crime and gave a detailed account of how he met his victims and lured them to the various hotels and murdered them by asphyxiation or strangulation. They failed to call the medical pathologist who should be cross-examined. And cross-examination is the hallmark of proceedings in court. Now they failed to bring that medical pathologist who carried out a medical autopsy according to them. The prosecution had not been able to prove its case. And uh, for that reason, we hold, we pray to the Honorable Court that the second defendant be discharged and acquitted. Both legal teams also disagreed over the credibility of evidence standard before the court by the state. In the uh, CCTV camera that was brought before the court, after he denied that he was not, that he did not go to any of those hotels, what to go get the CCTV camera from Imperial Hotel at Trasamadi, showing him coming into that hotel with a lady, and he booked a room in that hotel with the lady. In the morning, they discovered that the lady was dead. He was not there. And that video clip was turned out when the first defendant was being cross-examined and then the prosecution has closed their case and therefore it did not give the prosecution the, the first defendant an opportunity or even the defendants or at all to cross-examine on those evidence once again the first defendant created a scene in protest over alleged ill treatment by officials of the correctional services. The trial judge, Justice Adolphus Enabili, adjourned the matter till the 9th of October 2020 for delivery of judgment. Uche Okoro, TVC News, Port Hackett.